Hey guys, today we are going to be demonstrating why HTTP is not secure. HTTP began back in 1989, where HTTPS was created in 1994. That is a whole five years difference. Now, if we look real quick, we're, we're just going to do a quick, simple command here. It's going to just show us the hops that we're making across the internet to eventually get to yourdictionary.com. Now, I know at, at number nine at times out there, but this just gives you an idea that it, along the way to connect to any website, your network is hopping across the internet, okay? So think of it like a, a fucking super magical bunny rabbit that can jump to servers all across the world and that, that, that definitely can take your data through a bunch of areas. Now, we might think that when we're on a website, we're safe and, and we can search whatever we want, right? Like, for example, if we wanted to search P0RNLOL and we, we think, hey, by searching P0RNLOL, we're safe and nobody can see that, we would be very wrong. So if we look here, you'll see that we, we had a get request go through and in fact if we search porn lol exactly what we had then you can see it it's exactly in our get request and th that's not good because ideally we want to feel safe we want to think nobody can look at what we're doing but th this information here all across the way it, it it's potentially interceptable okay now it's primarily interceptable at the client and the server but all across the, the way, if someone was like, you know, globally monitoring the Internet, like, for example, in the case of the NSA, where they're able to just kind of look and see whatever you're doing. Hey, you know, it, it becomes realistic with the HTTP protocol. It, it's safer with HTTPS. So what I'm saying to you is that with how simple HTTPS is, right? So there's this there's this Let's Encrypt organization here that's run by... Um, Internet Security Research Group. This is a nonprofit, and they help with HTTPS or SSL certificates. Okay, they're basically they're like a CA, and it's free. A CA is a certificate authority. It's open, public. Anyone can use it. It's even automated. You you can literally download, type a command, and you're done. It, it's seriously the most simple fucking way to get SSL. It's free automatic and it's oh it's totally open anybody can do it so why not what well, why why do we still have the, the steal my login dangers what well, why can i still find my information in wireshark when, when i connect to websites it is 20 fucking 18 and we still have unencrypted shitty disgusting garbage poor infrastructure internet with a complete disregard for security, and, and we don't even care. There's DNS, okay? And, and then there's DNSSEC. Do you know how many people use DNSSEC? Like the fucking FBI? <laughs> yeah, so DNSSEC is free, it's public, like pretty much anyone can use it with, with your typical TLDs and, and depending on your registrar and whatnot, but yeah, like it's free. You, you can go set it up with Cloudflare, and your domain registrar, you click a couple buttons, you copy and paste, and it's done. DNSSEC is is more secure uh, for TCP, IP, or, or whatnot. Um, down here, you're, you're pretty good with HTTPS, okay? So this solves kind of these two problems, sort of. If you want to solve this IP problem even more, you'd certainly get a VPN. And ExpressVPN is an awesome VPN. But I'm not sitting here. I'm not trying to promote anything to you, okay? The only thing I want is a safe internet. I want the internet to be secure. And it, this this is an example, okay? So, like, this come get me at lols, okay? Now, this, this is fine and whatnot, okay? So, HTTP is okay, kind of. Uh, where where HTTP is not okay is that it's still man in the middle. It, it's it's interceptable. You know, like you can still get between someone with HTTP um, because it, HTTP is, is not. It's typically not secure. I, I it, real realistically, it's not secure. It, it HTTP is not meant to be a secure protocol. What people do. By, by declaring like schemes and saying, "Hey, we we just only want this data HTTPS." Why the why why even do it that way? Like, what 
that this is an example of doing HTTPS the wrong way. That this is not the right way. And, and my Google Chrome browser is telling me it's not secure because it is not secure. Do you think my name is James? No, my, my name is not James. You can think it's James. But anyways, the, the point of this whole fucking thing is that browsers are marking HTTP as non-secure. This started back in 2014, actually, that they decided HTTP, you can just see whatever someone types in, like a credit card number or password. It's not good. It says right here. But we still allow HTTP. So even though HTTP is unsafe, it's dumb, it makes no sense, there's a free, automatic, and open way to be safe, we, we still allow HTTP. It, it, chromium.org, chromium.org, your, yourselves, okay, this place that's marking HTTP as non-secure, where is my HTTPS? Why, why can I downgrade? It's, you know, security is one of those things where <laughs> it, it's funny. It, it really is funny. And it, it's just, it, it's honest to God, the stupidest fucking thing, because you can look at security all day, every day, and you can find issues and you can work security. You can love it. You can be passionate about it. But at the end of the day, we have so many fucking lazy people that do not take security like it, it matters. And what you end up with is uh, you know your your incognito browser marking uh, not not secure HTTP pages w with potential logins or whatnot, but then uh, to every other user it's okay. <laughs> no, wait, I'm I'm so sick of that. I'm tired of catering to insecurity on the internet. We need to just take HTTP away. You know I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a program. It's gonna block traffic on port eighty. Okay, that's it. Like there's there's no reason, and, and the reason I say that is because port 80 is primarily unencrypted web traffic. Port 80, port 8080. Um, it, as of May 2000, you you can look, you search up uh, RFC 2818. Okay, that's through the IETF. If you go to Google and search RFC 2818. You're going to find a whole fucking document. It's it's almost been 20 years where they talk about HTTPS. What, why the fuck are we not enforcing it? Like almost 20 years after we have a more secure internet website transmission protocol, it's still not being completely used. Damn it. Yes, I'm, I'm pissed off. So... Yeah, HTTPS, we, we should only allow that for internet traffic. By not doing so, we are putting the, the public at large uh, definitely at risk of man-in-the-middle attacks, uh, session session hijacking, uh, login hijacking, credit card theft. Like By allowing HTTP, you are literally being a dumbass. So if anyone is on board, share this video, let the world know, Let's stop HTTP. It, it's it's useless. It's garbage. It is not the safe method of website transmission, but we still use it, and it, it sucks. So HTTPS is is where we should go. And will, will this will this break plain HTTP sites? Yeah, because they suck. No, nobody wants HTTP. Do, do you, let me ask you a question. Do you like cancer in your body? Like I, I'm saying, like, do you want cancer? No? Okay, well then don't fucking want HTTP. Thank you.